Hello everybody! Right, so today I thought I'd um, just bring this up. So revisiting the Zoom G2.1U guitar effects pedal. It's got the wow wow or the expression pedal as they call it these days. Because it kind of does more than just the wow wow. And I just wanted to do this video because I'm going to give this to my mum because she wants some guitar effects to go with her guitar. And uh, I use a bit more up to date now, Positive Grid Spice Effects, but I am actually um, waiting on getting a Kemper amp at some point. So I'm going to look forward to that, but I don't know when that's coming. But uh, hopefully sometime in 2021. I was hoping it to be 2020, but now it's going to be 2021. So anyway, back to the Zoom. <laughs> So I think there's going to be a lot of affection towards this pedal with a lot of you out there. Um, there is with me. And with Zoom, when I started playing guitar first of all, or learning guitar, I managed to get hold of a Zoom 9000. And I bought that off of a mate who was also... He was more down the line with guitar playing at the time. So I was about 16. I started when I was 16 and he'd started when he was 14. I used to buy pedals from him that he no longer wanted or needed. And one of those pedals was the Zoom 9000, which was great at its time. So that's like um, 30 years ago, 31 years ago. Seems like yesterday. And then about 10 years after that, or maybe less than that, maybe five, six years after that, I bought myself a Zoom 505, which was great too. Quite similar to the this one here. This one's got more to it though, of course. <laughs> I've actually used these live as well and funnily enough in the instructions I found an old band photo of where I would have used the zoom pedal and um, that's me there so this picture must have been taken a good 20 years ago so that was a band called Local and that was a band in Bruton in the UK at the time so yeah, so this pedal, I always found it great. And I know that, and, and again, like I say, that a lot of people do like this pedal. And it's got all kinds of stuff on it. I'll play some clips of some examples of um, what it sounds like with uh, my Charvel guitar, San Dimas. We're recording to the computer via bias amp, so we've got like an amp simulator going. So it sounds, gives this a little bit of body. And also plugged it in, just did a few demos with this small bass amp, just to give you an idea of the sound and maybe remind people what it sounded like and uh, for that nostalgic buzz. Yeah, loads of things on here. This, this is play mode, as you can see. I won't go into too much detail. This is just like a little nostalgia trip, really. And there's also like a little drum machine, which you can play there and like practice along with if you want to and tap the tempo. Obviously you got the pedal there. And you can make modifications to any modulation sounds here and all reverbs, delay, EQ and other stuff, compressors, and so on. And you can store with the store button. 
And then you've got like three levels of control after that also with these three knobs. So you've got the power on in the back, so you put your 9 volt power supply in there, of course. Input, output, control, I'm, quite, I'm not quite sure what that is, that might be an extra switch or something. USB, I think that's for downloading extra patches, I think, to put into your Zoom, but I never used it, so I'm not quite sure. Batteries in there, if you want to use a battery supply. Display, which lights up, you'll see in the video as we go through. <laughs> toggle through each bank using the plus and minus buttons here. If you press these two buttons that bypass the effects, press them again and the effects are back on and that will switch to each effect in your bank. So there we are, a nifty bit of kit. I tried to look on online to see when this was made. I definitely had one in 2005-2006 because there's actually a video on another channel where I was just messing around with this pedal. If anybody knows, like I said, I've checked upon the internet. I've had a look on the internet to see when these were made, but I can't find the dates anywhere. So if there's anybody out there that knows when these were made, then please let us know by writing in the, a comment in the description below. That would be great because I'd like to know. <laughs> These are great value for money as well. Zoom were always great value for money. You can tell the zoom sound, and of course there's that effect on here which was used, that kind of bubbly effect which you'll be familiar with in songs like Headlong by Queen. And Dweezil Zappa did use the effect on his Confessions album. All right, Astro Cam. And did a kind of solo with that effect also. Dweezil Zappa, absolutely amazing guitarist. So there we are, Zoom, the Zoom G2.1U, G2.1U, bit of a mouthful. I'm just saying my last goodbyes to this pedal. Thank you for the service that it's given. So it's going to a good home, like I say it's going to my mum and she can play through this into the amp. Lovely jubbling. If anybody's got any stories about their own experiences with Zoom and especially with this unit, share your experiences in the comments below. Let us know what you thought and think of this particular unit and Zoom products in general. Got the instruction manual here, and like I say, before you got um, a drum machine and it goes through the beats here on the back. Good little manual. And it goes into more detail about the controls and functions there, connections. Astro Cat seems hyperactive tonight, I don't know what she's up to. If you end up buying one of these online, a Zoom, and you don't have the instructions, you can find the manual online as well. These days it's pretty good, you can find all the manuals for pretty much everything online, for anything, even the retro stuff, which is great. So there we are, Zoom. Zoom G2.1U. Got lots of fond memories with this pedal. So anyway, 
there we are. Just thought I'd do a quick video about the Zoom unit. If you'd like to add to the discussion, please pop a comment in the uh, description below. <laughs>so we've got some more videos coming up shortly lots of guitar related things and lots of music related stuff we'll see you then so thanks for watching and we'll see you soon see you soon the zoom revisited the zoom g2.1 the so revisiting the zoom g2 the zoom g2 one oh that was uh astro cat there trying to wreck the place. Lovely job, I believe.